Cheers. Welcome back to, I think it is week five now. I'm not, I, honestly, all the weeks are just starting to blur together. I can't believe I'm almost halfway through. What? This still feels like I just started. Anyways, I got my coffee. Very important. And I'm about to head out the door to go to another week of the Tech Ladies Boating Bo Booty. What? What? I don't know what I'm saying. Coding Boot Camp uh, here in Singapore. So, yeah, it is officially week five now. And. I'm going to be, uh, actually, I don't know what I'm doing today. I got my homework done for the week already, but in the process, I messed up a bunch of other things. So <laughs> it's like, hey, I did all this homework, but then I messed up things. So uh, I tried to fix that, but it didn't work out. So, um, but luckily when I get together with my coaches today, I can just be like, hey, how come when I fix this, now all of this gets messed up and so yeah, it's good that I have them. If there's anything specific you guys want me to do more of in the video or maybe do less of, let me know. I never vlogged at a cooking boot camp and holy, I can't believe how awkward I have been in the last few vlogs. I was just reviewing them yesterday and I was like, yeah, you can tell I was being really awkward about it. So sorry guys, I'll be a little bit better in this one. Um, I think I was just nervous in the other ones, that's why I was acting kind of weird. But I can walk you guys through more of what I'm doing today. I'm not really sure what's on the agenda today. I haven't checked Slack yet. Something cool I just discovered off topic is I can use my iPad to learn how to code. Now, it'll be hard to code on this thing, but I just discovered that the other day and I was like, I don't know why, that just really amazes me that I can learn how to code in basic front end web developing languages on my iPad. You don't need any uh, people, uh, you know, I get a lot of emails at people asking me as a computer science student, what kind of computer they should have. And I would say it actually doesn't really matter too much. I have a MacBook. That's all I've ever used to code a MacBook. But I think if you just want to learn how to code and you're not ready to build something of your own yet, I think an iPad or a tablet is, or even just your phone is perfectly fine to go on codeacademy.com. I mean, it's not as great as a computer, but I know some other websites that teach how to code have that, but you know, I'll make a separate video on that because I'm getting off topic. Anyways, on to week five. Woo, cheers. I'm really here for the snacks though. Hmm, what should I take? I think I'll get some nuts and maybe some crackers. Ooh, some chips. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, look at all those tea options though. Fruits too? What? OMG. There is a lot of things in here. The first coffee. In the last few weeks, you guys probably saw I was doing a lot of front-end things, but today, well, we're not the back-end team, but we're working on some back-end stuff. I personally don't have too much experience with that, but I think out of all of my weeks here at the boot camp, I'm definitely learning the most this time because the other weeks was more like, okay, I've done this before, but today it's like, okay, well, gotta know how to do this in another language. All right, I didn't film too much today because I didn't have much to show. I was trying to figure out how to do things because I struggle with actually using JavaScript. I've learned JavaScript, but when it actually comes to learning it, it's just like, oh, when it comes to actually using it, it's like way over my head and I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> but basically what happened was I had to completely restructure how a page was previously coded by another one of my teammates. 
and it was just kind of figure out what she was trying to do without messing up her coats too much and yeah it was all <laughs> so confusing but yeah i learned all about uh how to access data from uh, arrays within arrays that are inside another array and i'm also learning how view works the uh, terminology is uh, quite different from javascript i don't realize that like the uh, methods are called um, something else and uh, i'm just trying to learn all of that and reading up on the documentation and stuff like that overall i like the way how view works and um throughout this coming up next week i'm gonna try to learn as much as i can so i'm gonna go ahead and head on home i learned a lot today once again sorry for the uh, lack a video today i didn't have much to show actually let me show you a little bit what i've been doing okay so what happens is i'm so me and my team we are building a little quiz and what we are doing in this quiz is we have different categories we have six categories that people have to answer questions within the category and i'm just trying to learn how to pull the data in a different way i haven't learned before because normally i'll try to do everything in html but i'm actually trying to learn how to do it in a function like this so that way i don't need to type out the code all of this code and data out every time there is a new question on the quiz all i have to do is uh, change the value which is like the uh, the question for example and then the answer because the old me would just manually type everything out even though that's really bad cold code practice but for me that's like the safest way to learn so it's actually kind of pushing me out of my comfort zone a little bit to do something like this I'm learning a lot. Okay, but for real, let's end this day here and head on home. Let's go, guys. And we're back. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you don't forget to subscribe to my channel. That's the best way to support me. That lets me know that I should keep going and keep making more of these types of videos for you guys. Also, the second thing is if you could just give this video a thumbs up. No, I don't get any money for it, but it does let me know that I'm doing a good job and it encourages me to want to make more videos again. <laughs> All right, have a good one and I will see you next week, guys. Bye.